to release off your swivel wheel it's just the black bar here with the little red button in just pulling that up firmly and you'll see that the button pops out and that will release off your wheel pressing the red button back in and you heard it click it just goes back automatically to be flush and then it locks off your wheel completely large shopping basket adjustable handle and that's just by the two buttons that are on the side here squeeze and that either drops down or goes up to your position foot brake fold down what you need to do is locate the red button that's just hiding underneath your handle here so just squeezing that button what you'll find is that middle section will twist right over and it starts to go and then located on the right hand side here just where the red marker is just below where the button adjusts your handle you need to just pull that part up the whole system starts to go down just follow all the way through to the floor and what you'll find is that does actually lock off and it will freestand adjusting your handle makes that a slightly smaller package like so and then to put your system back up it's just the red clip that's on the side here just releasing that off by just pulling that down and then all that you do is to up and then all you do is just put your pressure on the back pull out the whole system and make sure you pull it securely enough to make sure the whole system is locked out ready to take either your carry cot or your push chair mode so you have your red arrows that are actually on the bottom of your seat unit and what you do need to do is get the unit in the red part into the part that's furthest away from your handle first and I've just clicked in and what will happen is as I go down you will see where it actually locks off watch the red part and that just locks that off so releasing off we're now aiming for that red button with the black bar pressing in depressing down tipping up the front part of your seat unit and that will then slide out foot muff front apron removable hood adjustable footrest by depressing the bar and that will allow that to go all the way down removable washable covers removable bumper bar by just the button on the side squeeze and release so for your hood to go down what you do need to do hiding on the inside rather than the outside behind the net part you have got your hood adjustment and that just pulls up and then it will allow you releasing off both sides for your hood to go back on the back of your hood you have actually got pressers on the bottom here so it secures it to your unit so it keeps it nice and neat but in summer weather or when you want aeration going through there just lift up that whole section and what you'll find is this is all fully aerated so the net part here if I just put my hand on the inside you can see where you've got all that nice airflow. five point padded harness with your padded straps and padded crutch strap your recline position is just located on the back here that single metal bar but you are never pulling out towards you you're always squeezing up so thumb on the top squeezing to your thumb grab hold of the bar squeeze and then it will go in your four set positions for locking off and then fully recline back so your zip compartment is for your carrying handle unzip reveals your strap removable washable liner removable hood just by the black button on the side squeeze and that just pops out easily front apron so inside your carry cot this is where the head of your child would be here and hiding underneath that's where we have that adjustment that we talked about where you could sit them up and what happens is it's just that metal bar that goes into the three set positions that you've got hiding underneath there quite easily on the back of your hood you have actually got pressers on the bottom here so it secures it to your unit so it keeps it nice and neat but in summer weather or when you want aeration going through there just lift up that whole section and what you'll find is this is all fully aerated so the net part here if I just put my hand on the inside you can see where you've got all that nice airflow.